Hi there, stampers and crafters. My name is Tammy White from stampwithtammy.com. And today, I'm going to show you how to make this super cool card. It uses the Stampin' Up! Cookie Cutter Christmas Bundle that's in the holiday catalog. I'm really excited to show it to you, and I'm also sporting my Stamp Out! Breast Cancer t-shirt because it's October, which is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and myself and my co-host Celine Kempton have kicked off our seventh annual Stamp Out Breast Cancer event, which we're hoping to raise $6,000 is our goal this year. And you can participate by donating and all minimum donations get a free tutorial. And I'll have some more information on that on my stampwithtammy.com blog. All right, let's get started with the stamping. And here is this flipping adorable gingerbread man card up close created by my friend Cindy Bauman. I just love that they're sitting on a little cookie sheet that is so adorable. You are going to want to make these in bulk for the, this holiday season. That's how easy these are. This card will be using the cookie cutter Christmas, the matching cookie cutter punch. And I have a free PDF on my blog that has all of these supplies and measurements on it, as well as you can purchase all these supplies in my online store simply by going to this URL or clicking in the link in the description below. When you purchase these two together, you save 10%. Let's start with some stamping. We'll stamp our gingerbread men first. He's super cute. So he's in crumb cake ink. So this is crumb cake ink and I'm actually stamping him on Sahara sand cardstock. And we'll go ahead and just punch that out while we have the punch right here. Just line that right up. punch. Next we're going to take the real red ink pad and stamp those words in the bottom right corner of our card base. So this adorable designer paper is from the Candy Cane Lane collection in the Stampin' Up! Holiday catalog. I'm making this in October. If you are watching this in October, these designer papers, all of the collections for the regular DSPs are buy three get one free. Fantastic deal, just saying. You totally want to jump on that if you are watching this before October 31st. So I'm attaching that with some snail adhesive. Okay, I'm going to pull that little gingerbread man punch out one more time and punch a few accessories for our gingerbread people. I'd say man, but it's man and woman. So out of the red, we're going to get a little heart and a bow and out of the espresso we just need the bow and now we're going to decorate our little gingerbread man and I'm just using so many glue dots for that just go ahead and stick the bows and the heart right to the glue dots and stick them right to our gingerbread peoples hopefully gingerbread peoples is the politically correct term <laughs> So this basic gray is actually a panel that's going on the card. It's going to be this border to the baking sheet that the cookies are on. I'm taking the three quarter inch circle punch from Stampin' Up! right smack in the middle. So you won't see this because we're going to cover it up with some silver foil. And I'm punching two circles and then we're going to go ahead and attach them with either snail or mini glue dots to the back on either side. Those will be the handles. Isn't that a cute idea? Oh my gosh, I just love this. And then silver foil fits right inside our little baking sheet. We'll take some Stampin' Dimensionals and attach our little gingerbread men and woman, ginger people. And Stampin' Dimensionals will attach that to our card base. Like so, oh, so adorable, so cute. Absolutely love this idea. So little rhinestones in the center of their bows and, and rhinestones for Mrs. Gingerbread's little buttons because she needs a little bling. And that completes our card and that really does complete it. It really pulls it all together. You can get the free PDF tutorial with all of the information and measurements on this card on my stampwithtammy.com blog 
And be sure to sign up for my newsletter while you're there because I send out free car tutorials every Tuesday. Thanks for joining me today.